Hey, thanks for clicking Weather on Demand. I'm Sean Householder with your forecast from UpperMichiganSource.com for Monday, March 24th. So we look back on the month of March so far, our average high just over uh, 25 degrees and uh, you can see our average low 1.6 degrees put them together and we've been more than nine degrees below what we expect for so far in the month of March. We continue this below average temperature trend as we start the day at the eight o'clock hour. The cooler spots are into the teens and 20s below zero right along that Wisconsin line. Places like Watersmeet, Amasa, Wakefield, Doe Lake, Spinsich Lake. We're checking in into the teens below zero. Lots of single digit below zero readings and there's also positive temperature readings too all over the place. So clear skies uh, through uh, yesterday and overnight into this morning starting to see some limited cloud cover working in. It is a nice sunrise though and clouds will continue to stream in especially associated with this next front. Now that front will continue to meander into the southern Great Lakes. That will bring a dose of snow towards uh, lower Michigan, but an Arctic front is what we'll be watching over the next 24 hours. That's going to settle in diving in out of Canada. That'll bring another shot of cold air. Here's what we're watching now into the teens below zero inland away from the lakes. But these uh, people as you look uh, further south, Places like Topeka ending reading into the 30s ahead of this latest front. So though we do warm up modestly, we're still falling short of what we expect for this time of year. And that Arctic front settles in. We'll get a little uh, snow, especially uh, near Lake Superior out of that into this afternoon and through this evening. Snow showers will begin to wind down, though. There'll be a few lingering snow flurries by Tuesday. This low pulls away. I think we'll be watching some limited uh, lake effect snow with a steady northwest flow. That'll keep that lake effect action going, but this high pressure will edge its way in. That'll eventually carve out clearing skies. We do warm up Wednesday ahead of this next front and then by Wednesday night into your Thursday, deep moisture on the approach. Looks like mainly snow, heavy wet snow. We'll need to keep the shovel handy for that one. And we're close enough to that front though. We also watch the threat for rain mixing with sleet and freezing rain into your uh, early Thursday morning. Details on that later, but again, keep the shovel handy for that one. We're not out of the woods yet. Highs today through the 20s, well below what we expect for this time of year. And it's been mainly sunny this morning, but clouds will be on the increase this afternoon and through this evening snow working in. Everybody getting in on a touch of snow, perhaps not much in the way of accumulation and then skies clear out tonight, especially into central upper Michigan. Cooler there as a result. Cloud cover keeps temperatures buffered into the single digits above zero all across the board, though. Snow lingers along that superior shoreline. Snow with breezy northwest winds into your Tuesday and highs struggle right through the teens, I should say. The TV six day forecast, so there is a warm up towards the end of the week. We'll, get, we'll deal with that slushy, sloppy mess Wednesday night into Thursday. Lingering snow and a cool Friday. Though we do look at the weekend, we warm up through the 30s and even through the 40s by Sunday. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.